if they have Galakron, I just I don't think I outvalue, right? It just never gets there, does it? Can I steal a Galakron? Yeah, I could get a Thought Steal off of um, Palm Reading, right? Get a Galakron that way. Oh my god! <laughs> what? Hey, buddy, watch this. Okay, priest. Interesting. Can we outvalue a traditional priest? I don't know. Maybe. I don't have Galakrond is the thing. Like, if they have Galakrond, I just I don't think I outvalue, right? It just never gets there, does it? I don't see how. I can, can I make a Galakrond? No. Can I steal a Galakrond? Yeah, I could get a Thought Steal off of um, Palm Reading, right? Get a Galakrond that way. possible skeletal dragons sub for galakron yeah but it, i mean in theory yes but it, it's just unfortunately it doesn't get you uh nearly as many cards long term right in a pinch you know sure but maybe one or two cards instead of like 10 or 15 but we might just be able to like tempo too like we could find a turn with flush giants and and gahoon or something where they just don't have an answer so you know we'll, we'll see if the game goes too long i think we'll lose but if the game goes just the right length, kind of a middle tier game. I think we've got a shot. Oh my God. If I, th if I seriously thought seal in the Galakrond right now, you guys owe me like a billion dollars. <laughs> what? What? I can't believe it. <laughs> that's unbelievable. I mean, that's actually insane. <laughs> oh my god. Oh my. I, I, I actually legitimately cannot believe that happened. Um, wow. <laughs> I just can't believe it. Um, do I want to use both Apoths right now? I don't know. Not really, right? But maybe. Okay. I, 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 I can't, I can't believe I got the Galakrod. It's, it's really quite, I need to take more damage. I need my knife fenders. I need my pin flinger. I need my stuff. Palm reading again. Okay. I mean, I guess initiation is the highest value card, but I'm not excited about it. Okay, so with with Galakrond, you know, I lose my quest hero power is the thing, but um, or I lose the Galakrond hero power, whichever I choose. But um, I I think Galakrond's still a better path to victory if I get it off early enough, right? Just chaining the button hits. Oh, I did miss a heal on his face. Oh, yeah, you're right, you're right, you're right. Yeah, sorry. I forgot we hit him. Uh, but yes, yeah, I should have. I just didn't notice. I think we just... I think we just... At the very least, we enjoy the Galakron for now. We can always go back later if we want to, right? I mean, I, I think we can muster enough healing later to go back to the eye after I've generated enough minions to feel comfortable. I must the only downside is if I do do this and I want to keep the Galakrond hero power, I can't heal enough. You know, I have to be careful not to heal too much. But I don't think that'll be an issue. Freeze isn't dealing a ton of damage. <laughs> British. Yeah, no, I was just... Uh, I was trying to think of the most absurd uh, reward possible. So a billion dollars sounded right uh thank you for the thousand bits though dude that's that's pretty crazy i have to say so you know i basically want to go like maybe five to ten turns with the hero power here and see if we can generate enough extra stuff uh to make it work out this turn's actually really awkward and i don't have a good answer here yeah this guy's big and nasty it's fine Okay. So, will I want to flip the switch back, right, on this uh, quest? 
probably get to a point where we don't really have a choice. You know, in fatigue, I guess the healing would be nice, but you also just want a lot of minions, so who knows. We're just gonna have to take it by, you know, how the game unfolds, basically. Okay, initiation there is solid, I think. I guess we're never actually gonna win in fatigue because of his stupid educated Elix, huh? I could, I could take the Elec and just shuffle in Renew. No, I'm not gonna push that hard for, for like fatigue. I think we're gonna just try to go more than that. Hey, loser. Okay. Gotta be careful with the hand size with this pin flinger. I know I'm gonna end up at 10 cards at some point. Same thing with Skeletal Dragon, like it's just so much stuff in hand. Um, Ahmet's cool though, I like Ahmet. I can work with Ahmet. I hope his Galakron's at the bottom of his deck so we can really win this value competition. Breath, okay, that hurts him more than me. Oh, never mind, he has Dragon. <laughs> Does not <laughs> take that back. Scratch that, still a very inefficient Breath. Not even any really clean trades here, because you don't get to hero power up. Uh, man, I would normally love Gahoon, but we're just not in a game state where Gahoon matters. This, this, uh, Elec, is it gonna ruin his deck, right? Am I gonna shuffle in a bunch of garbage? He's already kind of shuffled in a bunch of garbage. What's in here for me? The four mana corrupted thing, the one drop, maybe not that good, but I do have an Ahmet, so everything gets kind of better in Ahmet world. And I definitely want to put a bad raised dead in his... Oh, this guy, okay, cool. He does not get better in on that world. <laughs> He's exactly the same. Oh my god, golden Ahmet. Oh, I forgot I'm burning a card. I just talked about this. Skeletal Dragon. Ugh, that doesn't matter. Soulmere is the only thing I care about anyway. I need to dump this death. It's just stuck in hand. Really need to dump it. Oh, Fairy Dragon, by the way. Ugh. It's easy to play at least. Solmir's good for his Elec, unfortunately. That's a great card to put in, I think. So they can clear the uh, dragon, obviously. My Flesh Giants are gonna be free, and I'm gonna burn one. I know what's up, I know what's gonna happen. I've been in this world before. I've seen this in action. I can't clear this board. I'm just gonna die. I legit can't kill the clear the board. I'm gonna burn my Murazon. Oh, Murazon would have been really good too. Oh, I'm so sad. All right. Uh, yeah, I don't know. I, I don't really want to give him renew, but I need to. Palm reading. Sure. Wave. I don't know. Wave's probably. I actually already regret that. Wave's probably better, honestly. I see a dark future. I'm just not winning right now. Yeah, I'm just not winning. I don't know. I think we're going to lose. Murazon. Okay. Finally, something to use my death on, praise God. I see a dark future. <laughs> ben, like, you're just chilling there on board. I love it. That's funny. Didn't have room for this, I guess. My god, that Elec is full of 85 million things. It's literally got 10 spells in it. <laughs> I am not gonna win fatigue if I can't silence that somehow. I don't love that we gave them a Pinflinger. That's a little tough. Hmm, gonna take this trade, I guess? Huh. Or leave it up, maybe? Feels like that could have gone differently. I don't remember what else ran in, but it feels like there was something to run in there, maybe. Who knows? Ah, interesting. Aeon Re or a Why am I saying Aeon Reaver? That's what I wanted in my brain. I wanted an Aeon Reaver, so my brain's saying Aeon Reaver. Alrighty.
Alrighty. It's time to kill it. Let's put some garbage in the deck. No, never mind. I don't want an apotheosis. Screw that. Okay. This is a little intimidating, I guess, but... What am I supposed to do about it? Yeah, I just don't think I... I don't know. I don't see how, how to win. He's never going to run out of stuff. He's obviously got a million cards. I'm not going to outvalue. So how am I going to get a win done? All right. There's the garbage. I think, like, two of those cards were probably actually good. Like, legitimately good. Dance, puppet. Like, I'm gonna want to play these for tempo soon, but I'm, I just don't want to finish my quest. I need him to heal me. <laughs> Please heal me, man. Please. I need a, uh, Cabal Shadow Priest. Maybe. Oh, I don't know. I see a dark I'm gonna finish my quest if I do this. I don't want to. I don't want to finish my quest, guys. I think I still need the Galakron hero power. Gotta trade here because the Pinflinger kills it too easily, right? Oh boy. We got one more round of heals, basically. So I can't renew. I can't. Can't play the other Sand Hoof. I can't really Apotheosis, probably. Oh, that's game for sure. Too much. Too much. Fully invoked. Yeah, man, I needed flesh giants, dude. Where are my flesh giants at, man? Alright, let's see. Then 12 damage next turn. Bouncing the flinger pretty much always gives you lethal, though. I mean, I can heal, obviously. Just done here. Let's take one more. Great, great minion to get, man. Thank God we got that last minion. Solmir was was what I was looking for, but uh, it's it's really still not that strong. Oh, that Pinflinger animated really weird, right? Yeah, I just I can't I can't outvalue now. I have to get a crazy flesh giant turn or stick a minion and buff it like mad. It just what's not gonna happen. Not gonna happen. Did I finish the last prediction by the way? Um, did we win that game? No, no, we didn't beat the rogue. We lost. Right, guys, we lost to the rogue. I never finished that prediction. We lost to the rogue, right? Somebody tell me so I don't accidentally mess it up. I'm pretty sure we lost to the rogue. Chat. Chat, did we lose to the rogue? Cabbages, man, have a good one, dude. Thanks for stopping by. Thanks for the crazy bombs. <laughs> you won. Yeah, why am I? You guys are unreliable narrators here. Can't trust you at all. Is my hero power ever enough to stabilize this? I need I need flesh giants, like ASAP. That's the problem here. I can't find flesh giants. I mean, the good news is now I am kind of like free to play minions. Like, I mean, well, specifically Sand of Water Bear. And I guess that's really literally the only example I have, but... <laughs> Uh, gonna make an interesting move here, I guess, huh? Gonna add three cards back to hand. Okay, that's fine. Not, not bad, actually. Okay. So, uh... Basically, my thought was, like, let's just debuff this instead of killing it. It might be hard for him to heal without a hero power, so... If he tries to play big stuff now, it might just get really small, right? Um, instead of just killing it off, 
actually can I mean, of course he can trade it in but that's fine too then he's traded in his on we're in the same spot so are you scared of someone getting 100 million deaths now that betting is a thing no not really it's still a zero-sum system i mean they'd have to have an unbelievable streak of of uh good bets to to get there i mean it just seems impossible still it would be like it would just be so hard man his pin flinger is getting too much value dude Solmir, okay. Ah, debuffed. Not that it matters, but funny. <laughs> funny exchange, nonetheless. It's pinflingers, dude. Stop. Stop with the pinflingers. Sick of it. Sick of it. No one should have a pinflinger on their deck. I need, I need flesh giant tempo. Uh, I really want to play Skeletal Dragon Hero Power, don't I? Which means I'm not pinflingering this turn. Hopefully this deal's unanswered somehow. I, I don't know how, of course, but I don't know, maybe. He soul mirrored last turn. It wasn't that great. He's drawn a bunch of garbage half the time. Don't keep your thoughts to yourself. Mm, that doesn't help. Well, soul mirror, I guess, kind of helps a little, but, well, it helps. It clears it, but... Hopefully not this. If you got exactly Soul Mirror off that, I'm going to be a little salty. So we might be able to reach a point here where if he just doesn't have answers to my stuff, I just keep going over the top, right? Like, just keep doming him. Because clearly we're not going to win Fatigue. So just creating obscene pressure is the next best bet, right? Hit for 10 next turn, basically. Chip him down with Pin Flingers over the next whatever turns because he lacks healing. That's actually a possible win condition, too. I just don't have that many spells left. Two Penances... Two mass reses. Oh, plague of death. Okay, sure. I wasn't expecting one of those, but I can I can actually live with that. I think. Is this a Gahoon turn? Uh, actually, it's probably a flesh giant sand hoof, grand mummy hero power turn, right? Just try to go a little wider. All right, who's thirsty? Put this one to four. That's awkward for priests sometimes. Plays around Shadow Word, uh, ruin a little bit better. Catacoot, dude, thanks for the two months, man. Living in a gangster's paradise, huh? I don't know if that's... <laughs> I feel like... Oh, that's a good Murazon. Shoot. This doesn't get the buff, thank God, but... Still, too many big dudes. I do have the death to swing back, though, and maybe Renew finds me something, too. Also, just how much damage do I have? 9 plus 8, 17, 20 damage this turn. 24 damage this turn. 25 damage this turn. 26. Way less than 26 damage this turn. Weirdly enough, this actually enables me to get a an insane Shadow Word Ruin. Like, literally the best. <laughs> Can I find the Shadow Word Ruin? I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna pin flinger first because. I might want a hero power. Oh my god, Shadow Word Ruin would be absolutely insane. Oh god, I really felt it coming. Uh, Thought Steel could technically still find me a Shadow Word Ruin. Just spending more and more mana this turn, though. Which I don't love. Oh, oh my god. This is an insane Soul Mirror. Actually busted. Time is running out. Okay. So we know he still has a soul mirror. Oh yeah, we shuffled one in. That's right. That would be his third soul mirror of the game. Hopefully he doesn't draw that right now. Oh, mass rest is so bad for me. I mean, the odds of us hitting like multiple good minions off mass res is basically zero. I don't think we ever hit anything good off this, right? I still have a natural soul mirror in my deck too, huh? Okay. So, I mean, this is still a ton of damage. Madame Lazul, don't be what? Shadow Word Death is bad. Mass Res is probably bad for later, but maybe not that bad right now. Breath is means no. Did they get a death? Breath again. Man, this guy plays a ton of breaths. 
Pinflinger on this? Does he have Pinflinger left? Oh, he doesn't have a Pinflinger left. Okay. Uh, so this is a great Flinger Penance, I think. Just clean up the board. We're going to heal the 6 1, I guess, right? Kind of spread out the stats more again. Do I play a like Cobalt here? Oh, I'm an idiot. Oh, I'm such an idiot. Chat, don't yell at me. I'm an idiot. I'm such an idiot, chat. I totally forgot it was going to buff it. Uh, well, no, I had to in that order, too, though. Uh, I don't know. We're tossing out a Pinflinger. <laughs> it's, it's happening. Deal with it. It's a thing. I'm going to save this for a surprise, right? Yeah, that's fine. Fling their face and then death? Interesting. I like where your brain's at. Aw, oh, did this heal? Was it? I think this was the better heal target, but... I mean, if I'd penance first, I didn't bounce the flinger, so... There was no actual way to solve that. I just didn't notice it. I probably would have made a different play if I'd noticed. I probably just would have left it up and, like, cobalted. But actually, I think this is the best play. I don't really need the pin flinger... Um anymore necessarily i mean i don't hate the pinflinger it's actually kind of cool on board right now how much damage do i have uh five and four is nine ten do i have a way to kill this after it oh i can just pinflinger after surely this is lethal right oh i don't have a spell to bounce the flinger though i need a penance again spell can get me a spell but i don't have any mana left oh my god what what no What is happening? Do you guys see me? Oh my god, we're playing the greatest Hearthstone game in history and I almost disconnected. Um, I don't know if there's a lethal here. Oh, there's a lethal here. I just drew it. Pinflinger. Oh my god! Oh, I can't believe we won the game! That was such a crazy game! And we almost DC'd on the final turn. Oh my god, rigged! Paid actor, whatever. I that oh my god, the suspense, dude. <laughs> I don't know. I, I, I we don't, you know, it, we 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 figured it out, right? We drew the pinflinger, that solved all the problems, but uh okay, this is an intriguing hand for pinflinger, I'd say. I don't know if we can beat Shaman, though. Oh, yeah. I needed two mana for the hero power, too. Yeah, of course. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's even more mana commitment. Yeah, because that's three damage. Either way, we got it. The game believed in us. We believed in the heart of the cards, and Pinflinger rewarded us. The good, the good old Pinflinger Mass Res deck, man. <laughs> the ultimate deck. In my opinion. My humble opinion. Uh, Probably need to find uh, Solmir off this and make it really cheap so that I can kill their turn five play. Otherwise, I'm gonna die. Okay, Pendlinger can. Put in some work here, but I lose coin if I do it. Um, I guess actually Pinflinger Renew isn't insane right now. I think I'm actually cool with this, and I can I can dump the Ash Tongue too. Ruin's awesome. I think there's a lot of instances where Ruin will definitely clean up a big chunk of an Evolved Shaman board, so that's really good to see. Uh, and we're going to make it cheap as well, which is nice. Mischief Maker on three and pulled the opponent's Galakrond. Wow, nice, dude. That's fun. I bet they were salty. <laughs> I bet they were real mad. Wow, just playing those out, huh? When I have a Pinflinger in hand and a 1-4 on board. Interesting. They have a, There's no coins. They can't revolve. I have a Lightning Bloom, I guess. No. Wow. How intriguing. Okay. 
Power Word Shield doesn't really help me bounce a uh, Pinflinger, but Apotheos is great on this 1 4. So. That would be cool. Do I coin a Flinger and then. Oh, I don't have a dead minion. I can't raise dead. Oh, shoot. I should have taken the Power Word Shield, actually. This becomes a 4 drop. It rarely dies to Shadow Word Ruin. Oh, I regret that. that. I think I should have taken the Power Word Shield. I think that was wrong. Hey, Immortal, thanks, dude. Hey, thanks. That's awesome to hear. Yeah, I got to figure out the next Jilbin release. I got to... I don't know what my plan is right now. Cyberpunk kind of stalled out for me. I, I I don't know. I wasn't having as much fun as I wanted to, so... Just no respect at all for my minion. Just go on face. Like, unbelievable. Sheer, utter disrespect. Wow, that 3-1's annoying. Well, I guess not that annoying. I got pinflingers. Palm Rennie pushes each of these to one so I can play it. Okay. Holy Nova. Oh my god. Holy Nova is amazing, but it's three mana right now. It's a little bit too much. I don't think I need another Ruin, though, do I? That doesn't really help me. Yeah, I don't know about this. I'm not convinced I've made the right series of plays here, but... But at least the quest is pretty much done, and the Flesh Giant's pretty much done. If he hits this at all right, they're they're both going to be good to go. Just how do I win from there? I need I need the Ruin to take, basically. Like, I, I need this to be big enough that Ruin kills it. Not a Cairn, basically. It's all going to be exactly wrong for Holy Nova, for the record. Didn't hit the Soul Mirror I wanted, right? That's where this odd breakpoint's happening. Okay, Minion gets hit this time. Is Ruin good? Um, oh my god, this thing actually really helps me achieve the Ruin. Right? Because... This got bumped. Uh, these still didn't really get bumped, though. Yeah, Ruin Holy Nova is still pretty solid, actually. You must consider to kill the uh, remainder here, basically. Oh, actually, I can raise dead though. I have enough health. I can raise dead, and that activates the flesh giant. So never mind. This is good. This is perfect. It's kind of a dream turn, actually. I I'm out of cards and I'm out of uh, options, but I definitely resolved the board okay. Better than I expected. If I thought that Soul Mirror, maybe we got a game. I would love that magic carpet for later. Be sick. Treasure? Could not do anything with it with my pinflinger. Oh my god, dude. Fort Pillager double. Double. Uh, why is this stuck on screen, by the way? What in the world? Why is this the priest? Why is this still the priest thing? Uh, does Renew have anything on it that helps me here? Wave of Apathy, I guess, technically. Um, gonna, I'm not gonna use the Pinflinger first, because I don't know how much mana I need. Wave of Apathy, okay. Is there any way to just, like, race and win this game? I can hit for 12. Next turn, I could hit... Actually, yeah. Wait a minute here. Oh, am I dead, though, with the weapon? 7 and 4 is 11. Oh, yeah, I gotta heal my face. No, I gotta heal my face. Ah, oh, that sucks. I gotta heal my face. I think that takes away any lethals. Ugh. I gotta heal my face because he's dealing exactly 11, 4, and 7. I really don't want to heal my face here. Because I think this takes away my lethal outs. Because I can only hit for 11 plus, you know, uh, 4 is 15, 16. Yeah. It's ex it's one it's one damage off, basically. Oh, that sucks. If I, if, if I had had 12 health here, 
instead of 11, right? I could have buffed the minion. He'd be at 15. Next turn, I'd be able to just push this to uh, 14, right, on its own. Now I can go to 11. This is another 4. That's 15, 16 damage here. No backfires there either, and this almost kills me. Jeez. Is Solmir enough now? No. Is Murazon? He didn't do anything. <laughs> Murazon's literally just a dead card. Okay. Oh, that was so close, dude. We actually had a line. I had one more health. Oh, yeah. Knife Vendor. No, I think we could have lived around Knife Vendor, right? Um. Oh, no, you're right, actually. Yeah, but I still would have done that. I would have taken a tie for sure over the loss. It's so hard to keep up. I don't know how to fix it. Maybe I just need to run to AoEs. That was a pretty wide board that kept chipping in damage. I thought we could get away with it, but maybe we have to. I didn't, a Pinflinger would have helped that game too, though. Chipping away the 1-1s one -ones and stuff. Yeah, basically aggro always finds a way. It's like life in Jurassic Park. Aggro always finds a way. That's that's really a good a good summary, I think. It really does always find a way. All right, knife vendor time, baby. That's what it's here for. Let's go. You You're not gonna hit me? Well, I don't care. I'm gonna hit myself, dude. Screw you. Bring it. <laughs> I don't need you to hit me, man. That knife she's holding is huge, by the way. I don't know if that's like foreshortening and it's making it look big, but she is holding an enormous knife. It's a monster. Seems too early for Apoth, right? Oh, Are you a fan of knives? I didn't know that was your voice line. That's Rogue Guard, lady. Now my goal is to kill one of these with a fan of knives. That's actually a really good apotheosis, isn't it? It's probably too good to pass up. Uh, we can palm reading first in that case, just to make sure that this is ready. Renew is perfect, so let's do that. Okay, do we renew now? It's actually logical to renew face. It's logical to renew the minion to protect it. Um... I'm going to wait, because we might need the sand off. I don't know. I probably should just renew the minion. The thing is, Rogue is just so good at killing these anyway. It's hard removal stuff. We might renew the minion next turn. <laughs> Conjure Draven, dude. Thanks for the three months, man. Jeff Goldblum aggro Hearthstone. That's the answer. Huh. Not going to kill this one with lifesteal. Interesting. I am surprised by that. Really surprised. There's a chance to kill this one. Um, power infusion. I don't want to invest too much because the saps and stuff. Let's just let's just draconic studies, right? Skeletal dragons for sure are awesome. This is uh, gonna heal the minions, so that's fine. He's just gonna go face. Okay. Um, yeah, man. I didn't realize I got two mass reses. Where did these come from? <laughs> oh, I run these. Oh, these are in my deck. Oh, I didn't know these were in the deck. <laughs> you idiot. I had no idea. I didn't know. I built this deck a bit ago. It's been a while since I built it, so. So. Uh, they definitely need to kill my minions or they're just going to die. Okay. Oh, this is gonna die. All right. Can't believe they left this up. Oh, okay. There we go. That's what I expected the last time. I think you want to prioritize the life steal. I mean, you were gonna have to take face damage. Like, you know, if you're worried about your health, I get it. But it's just I would have done it the other way. I think. Or right or wrong. It's gotta be skeletal dragon, doesn't it? Oh my god, is this lethal? Oh my god, we're one mana off from dealing 13. 
Uh, are those the only minions that have died? It just occurred to me. Maybe they are. Quest is done. I have double. Oh my god, Deathwing! This is insane! <laughs> I love this right now. Um, we're one off lethal next turn. Unbelievable. And it's a great port. I feel like this, this poor rogue has had. Uh, not great answers. It just seems like their hand is really stuck up. It's like just not. It's clogged up. It's it's not flowing smooth. They do have the best card back in the game, though. Man, that's beautiful. Oh, can they clear this? Oh, it lives. They're dead. Oh my god, knife. I'm not even gonna get to use. Oh, I get hero power. I get hero power. I do it once. That's fine. That's fun. Cool. I'm, I'm stunned how much the knife bender damage and tempo actually mattered there, but I just wonder what was in their hand. They had seemed like it's just a totally dead draw. I feel pretty bad there. They kind of got ran over. I don't think that was their fault. They didn't do anything for like four turns. That's not a rogue line usually.